The Royal Swedish Academy of Sciences has decided to award the 2016 Nobel Prize in Chemistry jointly to Jean-Pierre Sauvage, Sir James Fraser Stoddart and Bernard L. Ferinja for the design and synthesis of molecular machines. Maybe this morning you ground your coffee. Maybe you used a motorized vehicle to get here. You used man-made machines operating on the centimeter to meter length scale. It's been the dream of scientists for over half a century to take this development all the way down to the molecular scale. So the first challenge for the chemists was to make something that can move. This one you may recognize from yesterday. This one won't do the work. It's beautiful, but it needs to be connected to something. One way to make a physical connection is this, somewhat more ugly, but here we have two wings that move relative to one another, but they're freely joined. There is no chemical bond between them. To make this one is a piece of cake. You can buy it at the local supermarket. This one requires some very clever chemistry. And this year's laureates have developed new synthetic strategies to make molecules like this with good yields. And you can actually see an example of such a machine in this little picture. This is a microscope uh, image. And you can not only see it, you can also see it moving, as you can see here. And they are really very tiny, these structures. Only a few nanometers in long length. A strand of hair is more than 1,000 times thicker. So really the tiniest possible machine you can experience. 